sauce flavor to it. And now the odds are greatly increased. <laughs> but before we go, we gotta deal with this guy. We can. I'll show you what we're gonna do here. I'm gonna barge in on his face quite well. What do you want? I got a guy coming along. <laughs> Kick the door right in his face. Knock him out. Serves you right, Todd. This view defines true beauty. Kick him while he's down. I think he's had enough. <laughs> All right. So next, uh, we're gonna I think he's had go enough. over here, which is this is like a little elevator here. It's a little bit hard to tell. It doesn't really tell you that's an elevator, but you just gotta play around with it. And uh, as you can see, this is all of his beautiful art here. I hope he's not trying to bring these to life or anything like that. And here we have Better hustle this back to Mo. Look at that. I had a dog with a funnel on its head when I was a kid. Ouch. I nominate that as least offensive of show. Not a bad version, really. That would make a good mailbox post. In hell, I'd rather just get out of here. All right, Ben, we'll do that. We'll get your torch and uh, get out of here. <clears throat> That's my welding torch. How'd you get it? Oh, it was just lying around. A pair of forks, little gas, and we're set. <laughs> Okay, off to get some gas. So we've got a lockpick, uh, and we've got a T-bone steak. Um, we're gonna use the T-bone steak to open that lock, but not really. We're gonna be using a lockpick. This is the tower to get the gas. Hmm. Let's go ahead and try to climb that. And blocks. See the coppers come and get us. They don't take kind of people steal their gas. Alright, sir. I'm talking to you, boy. You are trespassing on private property. Remain still, and we will not shoot you. I get to say fire before you do that, Floyd. Sorry, boss. Not exactly. We got to do something about those cops. I bet that we can probably hide from them. In fact, that's what we'll try to do. I'm gonna set off the alarms, and then you go all the way over here. You know, and it, there's no highlight which tells you that this is a hiding spot. It, it's unfortunate because it's kind of an obscure solution. Where are you? Hey, where is he? I told you, I nailed him last time. Set off the alarm, Floyd. Maybe someone is just fooling with us. Ah, oh, it's him. It's that guy can keep missing. Well, he can hold this thing still while I'm shooting. I'm going down for a closer look. The cops are gonna get out and they're gonna look around for you. I don't see nobody. He must have run away. Nah, we would have seen him running from the air. He must be hiding up in the tower. We got him treed. Let's go up and get him. left their vehicle here now. It's too bad that Ben just doesn't want to take this vehicle. Uh, you know, having mounted miniguns on it might help to 
get past the ambush up the road. But, I don't touch anything without wheels. But you know, he's a biker. He he likes the the feel of the asphalt. So let's go ahead and uh, let's just try to take some of their gas. I'd say that's where the gas goes. <laughs> And of course, to siphon it, you gotta suck on the hose a little bit and fill her up. Hey, who's that down there in the yard? It's him. Get him. Where? Over there. Quick. Spill you go around the other side, away. and we'll have him cornered. Where'd he go? Let's call it quits, huh, boss? No. Let's call on reinforcements. That yeah, might come to haunt us later, but you know, for now, we gotta get. Oh, good. You get this from the gas tower? Not exactly. Just a pair of new forks and we're on the road. So the last place is the junkyard. And uh, we should be able to get in there now. Previously, we saw that if you hold on this, um, you know, you couldn't get over to the entrance before it shut. But there is a latch here, right here. No lock. This. So we're gonna lock that bad boy up. Lock that thing up, and then we can climb over the damn wall. Ah, uh, junk. And the pitchforks are right there. Just the kind of forks I need, right on top. Well, not pitchforks, just forks. I love that face. And there's a junkyard dog which is gonna be guarding. Down. Need. Bad dog. We do have a T-bone steak though. And uh I heard that dogs like steak. I don't know if that's true or not, but let's Go ahead and give that a shot. See if uh, see if this dog likes steak. <laughs> and what we can do is we can throw this under a car. Here, Poochie Pooch. Pooch. Get stuck in the car. You don't have to eat much. simply because it's really hard to know that you can move to the right here. This is another one of those things about the game that doesn't do a clear job of telling you can go over here. But you in fact can, and you have to, and we're going to. And uh, here we see that there's a crane. And, you know, we kind of saw this viewpoint when we were down here, um, so we knew that there was a crane of some sort, we just weren't sure how to get there. Um, so, I think this is down. Down. 
Let's go get our fork. Nice forks. Where'd you find them? Right next to the knives and spoons. Well, that's Very it. Witty, Wait ben. outside for a minute Very and I'll finish witty. her up. I'm working on a surprise. I hate surprises. All right, here she comes. Am I cool or what? You're amazing. I should crash that thing every day. So what's the surprise? Oh, just your average everyday pre-regulation destroyer class solid fuel recoil booster. You're serious? Yes. But only the vultures. I have my connections. Now, are you gonna try this thing out or not? Ooh-wee. Wish I had a camera. I wish I had some way of paying you back. Just beat it, will ya? You're scaring away my regular customers. Bye, Mo. Send me a postcard from the ambush. Stealing that gas. We're gonna have to deal with them. So, uh, yeah, that's where we're gonna leave off for the day. Uh, we fixed up our bike. Uh, we met Malcolm Cromley, Corley, uh, and Adrian Ripberger, uh, which, by the way, was voiced by Mark Hamill. And, um, so, uh, the next thing we're gonna have to do is figure out how to get past that ambush. Or, sorry, the uh, blockade of police officers. So we're going to do that next time. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you uh, in uh, Act 3, I suppose, once we save this. Act 3. All right. See you guys later.